If you were alive in the 1970s, you know this guy. This is the G.I. Joe Air Adventurer from the Adventure Team. One of the things you also know is that this guy had a lot of cool gear, uh, a lot of which were backpacks that converted into vehicles, like the Undersea Explorer and the Escape Car, and my favorite, the Turbocopter, which had a button to press and allowed a rotor blade to ro uh, rotate over his head so he could fly. Uh, with my 3D printer, I thought, it's time for G.I. Joe to have a new vehicle, and here it is. It's the G.I. Joe Jetpack. It's designed to be compact, to fold together so that he can carry it on his back or it can be carried in a small vehicle like the ATV. He would take the engines off and snap them back into place. And the next thing you do is lift the harness up, pull the harness arms away. These are on hinges on the side. Lift his arms. The, the harness is designed to fit down over his body and the side harness arms snap to the harnesses here and here. Then the control arms swing down on a hinge. His Kung Fu grip can grab the control handles like so and he's ready to fly. This is printed in a high-vis yellow which is a, a material that I use to print prototypes and test prints. Not usually a finished product unless it calls for it. Uh, there's not a lot of detail on the back right now, and I'm going to be adding details to the to the vanes, to the ho engine housings. Uh, but one of the features I added was this wheel, allowing anybody who's flying GI Joe to fly forward, backward, hover, and land. Um, as I said, I'm going to be adding detail to this. Uh, and well, here's one right now. I printed a final uh, engine housing in a Finia Premium Yellow, which is a much nicer color, and matches the G.I. Joe Adventure Team vehicle. I printed these red uh, vents on the side and the struts and hub are printed in black as four separate pieces. The vein in the middle is red. These uh, struts and hub are snapped together by friction right now. There's no glue holding any of this together. These are designed to snap into place. They're printed uh, with precision on the Affinia. Uh, another thing I'm going to be doing is adding uh, color to the joystick so that the joystick uh, control mount and the handle itself are in two different colors as well. And so when this is done, G.I. Joe will have a vehicle to be proud of. Hope you enjoyed this video.